Hi, my name is Nick Barr with Mardon Resort out here on beautiful Potholes Reservoir. And I'm here today to talk to you about blue-green algae. Now, the state recently released a press release and did a, a couple testings out here at Potholes Reservoir that uh, said that we have blue-green algae, uh, which potentially has the uh, uh, effects of being toxic um, to humans and pets out here on the lake. And the fact is that, yes, there is some blue-green algae present in the lake, yet it is not present in the main lake, and it is present in areas of the lake that are anywhere from 7 to 10 miles away from our swimming beach, the state park swimming beach, and other main areas of the lake where people from all around Grant County and all around Washington uh, come to have fun and play and fish. And so I'm here to tell you a little bit about what blue-green algae is, and where it can be found on Potholes Reservoir. Blue-green algae is actually found in almost every single lake in Washington State. Uh, it's found in anywhere from little ponds to big reservoirs. And the only time it ever becomes toxic is when certain weather conditions, such as heat and stagnant water with not a lot of water flow, uh, create these conditions where blue-green algae actually thrives. And not all blue-green algae is toxic. <laughs> only part of the time when it blooms is it actually turn toxic. So you don't have to worry about every part of the scum on the lake. If you find any areas of scum, you don't have to worry about every single area of scum being toxic. But do watch out. We do advise to watch out for areas that have a blue to green light scum on top of the water or it kind of looks like a blue green paint on top of the water. But the only areas those can be found on our reservoir, which is 28,000 acres, is as I will show you in this map. As you can see, this is a map of Potholes Reservoir. Now, here's Mardon Resort, and here's the Potholes State Park. And these are the areas where the blue-green algae has been found on the lake. Now, Lynn Cooley, up here in the Lynn Cooley arm, some blue-green algae has been found in a very small remote section of Lynn Cooley. And it's almost more than seven miles away from Mardon Resort, and even more farther away from the Potholes State Park. Now, if you look up here, the second area where blue-green algae has been found is the Job Corps Dyke area. This Job Corps Dyke area is very far back into the sand dune region of Potholes Reservoir, and the Job Corps Dyke is not even accessible now by conventional boat due to the water level on Potholes Reservoir, which is 13 feet low, and you can only get back about this far into the sand dunes with a conventional boat. And so we urge people to take into consideration the uh, Department of Health statements and our statements, and uh, we look forward to seeing you out here on Potholes Reservoir and having a fun time. Once again, this is Nick Barr from Mardon Resort and Potholes Reservoir, and we look forward to having your business and having people come out here and enjoy our great lake in Grant County.